Hi everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. My name is Brenda and for today's video, we are going to be doing a winter decor haul. A lot of these items will also be very, very versatile so you can use them throughout the entire year. And that is basically my goal for my winter items. Typically for winter, there really isn't a collection like release in any stores, which they should honestly, cause they skip right into spring. And honestly, that was like, I was a little set back because they release it the day after Christmas. And I'm just like, wait, hold on. Like, did this happen last? year because I don't remember spring decor being released the day after Christmas. So for today, these items will be very versatile. So they don't necessarily have to fit winter completely. They are items that I will be using for my winter decorating. So hopefully you guys enjoy. Definitely let me know which item is your favorite. And anyways, we're going to go ahead and hop right into it. If you are new here, don't forget to hit the subscribe button and let's jump right into it. So the first ones that I want to talk about that I think are must haves for the year 2023 is these Alexandra Pepper Mills. If you guys haven't seen these already, then you are missing out. These are so gorgeous. Not only are they just so easy to use, they are beautiful. And honestly, like I am so glad that I finally picked these up and there's different options. So I bought them from Meridian. They are a new year company and they just look like this, which is so pretty. So I have the smaller size and the bigger size and they just look like this. And I am obsessed with these. We use them all the time. My husband loves them. Every time he grabs them, he's like, these are my favorite things ever. So anyways, these are definitely must haves. And I do want to mention, so these were $200 for both of them. So a hundred each and they come in a set. They are a little bit on the more expensive side. So you can definitely, you know, decide to splurge on this or you can save a little bit of money and get yourself the cheaper ones. I will give you guys all the links to everything. So you guys have different options, but these are must haves, you guys. These are so beautiful. And I just like, I, every time I walk into the kitchen, I'm just like staring at them because of how pretty they are. <laughs> okay, so this next item I picked up from Michaels and they're these beautiful flowers. These are a little bit more on the spring side, but I do think that they fit well regardless, specifically for anyone that does like to decorate with flowers. I mean, flowers are for all seasons. And I, I'm very curious to see what um, Trader Joe's has right now for their seasonal flowers. I'm guessing it's going to be spring because we are in California, but these are so beautiful. And I think they're perfect, honestly, for, for winter because they're just white. They're not colorful. They're not pink. They're not yellow. So they're not necessarily too spring and they have a little bit of green in there. So these are so beautiful. I've been eyeing these for a while and I knew that I was going to pick these up when I saw them. Um, I was shopping for, for Christmas decor and I'm like, okay, I'm just going to hold off on them just a little bit. So right now they don't have a sell on these, but when they do, they're going to be probably like 40% off. So anyways, these are so, so pretty and I can't wait to use these. So definitely recommend picking these up as well. And I do want to mention that today's video is sponsored by Magic Linen. So thank you Magic Linen for sponsoring today's video. So I wanted to share with you guys the products that they sent over to me. And these are definitely going to be staples in my winter decor, specifically because it's linen and it's such a beautiful fabric. It's so airy, so lightweight and very luxury. So I am so excited to be using this. I actually used this tablecloth for my New Year's tablescape. It looks so beautiful, but I am obsessed with this fabric. So Magic Linen is a sustainable, ethical, and handmade company. So all of their products are handmade and they are based in Europe. They have everything from bedding to kitchen items, clothing, random home decor accessories. They have so many different options that you can choose from. So I will have all the links down below for you guys so you can check out their products. But I want to share the ones that I picked out because these are my favorites. I went through the entire website and these I just could not pass because they were so beautiful. So the first one, of course, is the tablecloth. This is such a beautiful natural look and like color. And honestly, I think this could be used so many different ways. A different option if you don't want to use it for a tablecloth is for like a picnic blanket. That's definitely something I'm going to be using this for because you can use it so many different ways. Then I also picked up this beautiful bread bag. I love the quality of it. I love that it has like this you know, really natural looking string to tie it with. It's not anything too bright from you guys know. I love things that are natural and very like neutral. So they also have napkins and they have mats. And for the napkins, I also got the same color and it just looks like this. You guys can see how airy this is. Like this is so like, oh my God. And then the last item that I picked up from there as well is these beautiful little spoons. They come in a set of two and I'm going to give you guys a close up of these. So they're like these really pretty just handmade spoons and 
I love the natural texture that it has. You guys can kind of see the grooves on it, hopefully. And then it has like two different tones. It has like a little beige like tone going around like the rim of it and it has some texture on here as well but anyways definitely stay tuned so you guys can see how i style those products in some future videos and also make sure to go check out magic linen go see the products that they have make sure to go click on the link down below so you guys can go check out their products and thank you again magic linen for sponsoring today's video all right so moving on to some other products so we're gonna move on to target because they did a spring release and I did a video all about it that I will link down below for you guys as well but I don't know why they decided to do spring so early like that's just so crazy to me if it would have been like the first week of January okay sure but the day after Christmas come on that's like, that's just reaching. That's too much. But I had to pick some stuff up because obviously those those things are gonna sell out regardless. The collection is not gonna wait for me. So I had to buy it anyway, which honestly, I think we all kind of contributed to them releasing it so early because now they're like, oh, we can release it even earlier, which is terrible. Maybe we should just all like boycott Studio McGee at this point or Target, honestly, Target Corporation. Okay, we need to boycott their corporate because <laughs> I don't know who made the, the decision to do this. Not okay. Um, so anyways, I picked up some of the Studio McGee Spring Collection items. The first one is the marble dish. So I had a lot of people say that it was really tiny, and it is. It is very, very small, but I do think that it's great quality. So I bought this one online. I feel like a lot of people have been getting the beige one, which I'm really jealous. I still haven't been able to run, to it, run into it in the stores, but they sent me the one that's more like, I guess, cement looking. Um, it looks like a moon. <laughs> <laughs> um but anyways this is 25 dollars and it's beautiful i actually will not be using it for decor i'm going to be using it for jewelry i think i think it's such a perfect little item just for like you know it's a catch-all little tray so i think that would be perfect for this and you know what's funny too is that i think jenna pierce just released a video of her like showing how she styled these items and she actually did the same thing and i'm like yes that means i'm doing it right so i'm glad that i wasn't the only one that thought about that because it is really small but i think it's perfect for jewelry so anyways the next item that i picked up is this really pretty little bowl this one has that really pretty patina going on to it and i'm so sorry if i keep saying pretty or cute it's like really bad habit of mine but anyways this one is really nice <laughs> so this one isn't from the studio media collection but it is from the bullseye section and it's this berry bowl and it just looks like this it has a little handle on it and i love the color i think it's so pretty just for like winter spring kind of decor and i really like it so anyways i picked this one up and i think that the hearth and hand collection actually has like a berry bowl set that i think is really cute as well i might end up switching it for that one because i do like the more new muted neutral colors but i did want to show you guys this one because i thought it was really pretty all right so moving on to some other items so these i picked up because once again like i said the collection does not wait for us which is unfortunate but i did want to pick these up even though they're not necessarily winter related but they are going to be a great transition item so the next item that i grabbed as well is this really nice throw pillow this one is 22 dollars. it's also from the studio collection i really love the design that it has it's a little bit scandy and it's kind of like flowers not entirely but it's very beautiful i grabbed this one and then i also grabbed the one that's right behind me so this one's just a striped one i love any striped pillow this one is not studio mickey this is just threshold but it's also one of their new ones and this one is twenty dollars so i grabbed these to as well and another item that i also picked up is this beautiful marble tray so this one was 40 dollars, and this one's also from the threshold collection not studio mcgee or hearth and hand but it is gorgeous look at this oh my gosh she is so pretty i'm so excited to style this this is like exactly what i've been looking for i've been looking for a tray that i would love and i've looked at home goods i've looked on amazon and i just couldn't find anything that i really liked this is exactly what i've been looking for so i'm so excited to be able to use this and it's the perfect size as well it's not too small it's not too big it is literally perfect so this next item these are not from the collection as well but these are my staple items for my winter decor so this one is a beautiful little pleated lamp these are from target the one behind me is also from target and these are just so so pretty and they 
are literally just gorgeous and I think they also might have like an off-white color I really like the white though and it's just like I think these are really like in style right now and I have this one in my entryway if you guys are interested in seeing how I decorate for winter then that's gonna be my next video so make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss out on that video all right moving on to some other items so this one's also from the studio me collection and it's this really nice little candle holder it's $15 and this one also kind of has a little bit of a patina, not too much. They didn't definitely did not try as hard as they did with the bowl, but it's the same bronze color. So this next one is probably one of my absolute favorites from this collection, and it is this frame. Oh my god, I'm obsessed with this. I had a lot of you guys actually message me on Instagram saying like, you guys are so happy that they finally released a frame or a portrait that looks like us. It, it makes me happy knowing that there's a print that looks like me. <laughs> so anyways, um, there's that. And that is my absolute favorite purchase out of this entire thing. All right, so that is everything that I got from Target. And that's probably all I'm going to be purchasing for pretty much the next couple of months until we're ready for spring. And if I'm being completely honest, I don't think that I'm gonna be buying anything else from Target for like the spring collection. Cause a lot of stuff they have is like, I don't know, I feel like they're just kind of repeating it year by year. And I want to have more of a unique home. I don't want all of my stuff to look like it's from the Target store, you know? Like I have a Target display in my own home. I want to have some pieces, of course, but I don't want everything to be that. And I think that's so important to always keep in mind when you are, you know, basically shopping is try not to buy everything because then you literally your home is going to look like every other person's and you're also going to look like you're a target store <laughs> but the next item that i purchased this one is from amazon i've been wanting to buy this one for a very long time and it's the sunday suppers recipe book and this one i also love you guys can tell it also has like the linen look to it which i'm obsessed with um and i love the color and it's so perfect so i'm actually going to be replacing my hearth and hand magnolia book for this one. I only use these for decor. Most of my recipes I actually find online, like on my iPad or on my phone. So I don't really use books, but I do like to use them for decor. So this is another one that I also picked up. So moving on to another item. This one is from Amazon as well. And it's this beautiful checkered towel, hand towel, napkin. It's so pretty. So the brand is Calcadon, which I'm not sure what that is, but it was, I think about $14 for this napkin. So beautiful, my God. I've actually seen this exact same napkin on some designer sites for like triple the price. So finding it on Amazon, the exact same thing for $14 is such a steal. I will definitely make sure to link this one for you guys down below. I love the checkered look and I love the feel. It's so big. I honestly think you could use this as like a hair towel. <laughs> If I'm being honest, like, look at how big this is. This is massive. So I love this. I have it actually hanging on my little command hook next to the fridge. It has a little, like, hook here that you can hang it. So that's how I have it. I think it looks really cute. But you could also hang it on your stove or whatever you'd like. Next item is from At Home. This one I always get questions on, so I thought I would share it with you guys. And it's this beautiful little pot. So this one is actually for a plant. It's meant to be for a plant. It has a hole at the bottom, but I like to use it as a spoon holder. I love the detailing that it has here. It has that vintage look to it. They have different sizes as well, but this one's like the perfect size for some spoons. I would recommend going in store to actually look at this one because I I did notice that when I tried linking this one online, for some reason the picture doesn't change. Even though it is the eight inch one, I just like, I don't want you guys to order it and then have them send you something different. So I would definitely go in store if you have one nearby to check it out just in case because usually when you put the different sizes, the picture will change. So I don't know why it doesn't do that. Maybe it's just like an error on their site. But anyways, this is one of my top favorites. All right, and moving on to some final pieces. So if you don't have these already, I would definitely run to Home Goods to see if they have any, and it's gonna be these decorative boxes. So these are so great for styling. They always have different kinds. I bought some last spring or last, you know, like last new year, and they only have them at the beginning of the year from what I've noticed. I don't know, maybe it's just my store, but these are so beautiful. So I picked these up this year, and I loved also like the pretty natural linen fabric that it has. You just can kind of see what I'm going for here like with all like the natural fabrics and linens and the pleated stuff like just a lot of texture this one has like this little marble 
like thing here and basically just opens like this which i think is so cute i love that <laughs> that sounds so fun <laughs> um and then also the bigger one and it just same thing so you could either put stuff in here like remotes or just random knickknacks or you could just have them as decor i like to have these for like remotes and stuff for like our family room so like this one for example has a remote in here and um for this big one i'd probably put like maybe like um you know the gaming remotes and stuff for my husband they fit perfectly in the bigger one so that's what i like to do with these and then another thing that i want to share with you guys last and final thing is magazines so our house is probably sending out all of their spring items very very soon so I definitely recommend going to their websites and actually signing up for the free magazines. These are all free. So I believe Our House sends one. I think Restoration Hardware also sends one. Pottery Barn. And maybe a couple other ones if I can remember correctly. But basically you just go to their website and you can find their magazine section and sign up for free. And they will send this to you. So this one's the Spring 2023 collection for Our House. And there's just so much inspiration here that you guys could like look through. So I definitely recommend getting this just to sit down and go through this if you need some winter inspiration. But anyways, I really hope you guys enjoyed today's video. Definitely let me know what your favorite item was and if you are going to pick any of these up. And I hope you guys had a wonderful new year and I will see you in my next video. Bye guys.